liked it on the last day of the celebration harvest thing because, well, I'm a big fan of fruit and I absolutely love strawberries. So, I, so there was like one piece of melon, one piece of pineapple and one piece of everything else, but there was like half the cup of strawberries. Mm -hmm. <laughs> did you eat them all? Yeah. Good. <laughs> what about Verity? What did you like the most? I liked um, putting all the seeds in because the the blue carrot seeds or they, I thought they would be like a different colour, but Did they you? were kind of like a blue kind of greeny lime colour. That's right. I'm glad you remembered that. Were you surprised <laughs> how small they were? Yeah, they were about. Yeah. And what size were they at harvest day? What size were your carrots by then? This was our biggest one and this was the yeah. tiniest. I, I had the smallest one and this was the biggest one. I had a uh, potato but it was like massive. It was like... I think and it had a nose. Kitty had a beetroot that was pregnant. No, it, oh, wasn't, really? a beet, it wasn't a beetroot, it was, was a carrot. It, was it a funny shape yeah. when it, it came out? It was basically a normal carrot and then it had an extra little bit on then and an extra bit on the bottom, so I thought it was like a pregnant twin. So we're here with uh, Trevor, the head gardener of the Annick Garden and the Annick Garden Trust. Would you like to tell us what's happening here today, Trevor? Well, today we're harvesting vegetables with school children. These children have been in part of a project, uh, which is part of our charity work here at the gardens, where we've taught them how to grow their own veg and their own fruit. And so the children came in in the spring, sowed seeds, then they pricked them out, potted them on, planted them out, and today they're harvesting everything they've grown. So they're digging up potatoes and carrots and turnips and beetroot and all range of fantastic vegetables. Many of these children don't realise that what they're digging up actually comes up out of the ground. So to see a child pull out a carrot, they never imagined a carrot grew in the soil. Most of them just think carrots come out of the freezer or from the supermarket shelves. So it's a real education for them. As well as doing that, we talk about healthy living, healthy living lifestyle with lots of exercise, of which we work in partnership with the Healthcare Trust. So all in all, a fantastic day. Children very excited to see exactly what they're digging up. Thank you very much for that.